Hello, and welcome to Prince of Persia, Sands of Time. Yes, um, this game I remember playing around, uh, my late teens. It was a, uh, fairly good game. I don't remember having much problems with it. Um, I have one problem with its current incarnation, is that y you can't use the, uh, control pad. Well, I'm using an Xbox 360, uh, control pad and here let me let me show you uh controls and here's here's the game pad see like usually when you assign it you you go into one of these things and uh, you hit one of the buttons see i'm hitting the buttons all over the place and it's not working so i have to use the default default uh, keyboard controllers and these sort of games are not meant to play that way. That's my only gripe that I have with it so far. I played a little bit, and I think I can get used to it, but I don't think I want to. But, you know what? Is, let's, let's just go along with this. Also, it was on a default setting that had it at uh, Fog. And with Fog, it made the game completely unplayable. Um, you like The only thing you could see was like uh, the light... That very, very bright light. Not even the curtains you couldn't see. You could see this light over here, but you couldn't do anything else. Now, I'm going to shut up so that you'll be able to understand the backstory of this. Ah, shit. Hold on. Alright, I'm sorry about that. Let's try that one more time. You might have a hard time hearing what I'm saying, or maybe I'm just shouting unnecessarily, but, uh... I think the intro is... I, I think the intro is a little important, so I'm gonna stay quiet for this part. Most people think time is like a river that flows swift and sure in one direction. But I have seen the face of time, and I can tell you, they are wrong. <laughs> Time is an ocean in a storm. You may wonder who I am and why I say this. Sit down, and I will tell you a tale like none that you have ever heard. Know first that I am the son of Sharam, a mighty king of Persia. On our way to Azad with a small company of men, we passed through India. <coughs> where the promise of honor and glory tempted my father into a grievous error. Oh, my son! Your Majesty, I trust you will remember your promise. The Maharaja's treasure vaults lie within. See. Like a warrior, son. Do you think I felt regret as I gazed upon the destruction we had wrought? Or at least humility at the speed with which a world can be transformed from a good work into a hell? If you think so, you are mistaken. For in that moment I thought of one thing only. The honor and glory I would bring my father by fighting like a warrior in my first battle. Okay, I apologize for that. Just... Holy hell. Hell. I hope that dude over there wasn't my father. Anyways... I remember, uh, let me see. There we go. Now, I remember playing this game, say, uh, what year was it like? I think it was 2004? On the GameCube. Uh, to run up, run towards, well, well right click. Oh, right click, that's what it was, okay. <coughs> Excuse me. I was, uh, it was a 2000, f oh, sh <laughs> fail. Turn off uh, special action, right click. Okay, cool. I was supposed to jump this. Bam! 
And I remember playing this game, and I thought it was like one of the most advanced games ever. Of course, in the same exact year, I got uh, Donkey Kong... Uh, oh, what was that one Donkey Kong game? It was the one where you had the bongos. And... Ugh. It was a really good year. At least for me personally. Also, I got a DSi in the same exact year. Alright. What are you doing, huh? I'm gonna mess you up. Yeah, I went ahead and I uh, did a bit of the tutorials so that I wasn't sucking completely while I was uh, starting up the game. Yeah. Gotcha, buddy. Well, somebody's not having a good day. Oh, yeah, that's a little annoying. I think it'll stop uh, eventually, at least I'm hoping. Many and men that day sought to win honor and glory on the battlefield, that their king might say to them, as Kosro said to Rustam, You are the noblest of my warriors. Mm. From the moment my sword tasted blood, I knew this would not be my way. I would win my father's praise, not by killing, but by being the first to find the Maharaja's treasure vault and the wonders within. Hmm. Sounds like we got daddy issues. Okay, here we go. So, oh. Yeah, I went ahead where I learned how to uh, wall jump. Learning how to do that uh, vaulting thing. Oh, gosh. <laughs> All right, cool. That will become necessary. I think he was going to die anyway, guy. Also makes you realize, like, uh, the progression in uh, video games that they had. Like, uh, if you'll notice uh, the way that he looks like a doll, uh, nowadays that's, like, uh, nearly eliminated. But then again, you'll play some games and notice that it still has it. Um, like in Borderlands 2, you'll notice that when you die, you'll look like a doll. At least with me and the Mecromancer, I notice that she, like, she looks completely like a doll. But then again, you know, that game is supposed to be... Oh, here we go. Oh, no, 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 no. Whew, that was close. Um, I was supposed to right-click. That's how I'm supposed to do it. That's the special button. All right. But yes, um, it looks like he has a face. Um, his hands... Don't look like they did in, uh, let's see. I could get different views, by the way. Um, maybe you'll be able to, oh, there we go. If you look at his hands, it's all, like, they look like they're actual fingers. That Sometimes they look like they're wearing gloves, but, uh, you know, it's a special time in, uh, video game, uh, development. Oh, what was I thinking? Where they're starting to know what they're doing. GameCube, PlayStation 2... That's when I was thinking that it was starting to get awesome. But then again, it's not perfect. Oh! Wall! Whoa! Yeah! See why it would be very crucial to uh, learn that uh, vault move? You could take out these guys in one turn. But I still don't think it's necessary to put away, like, have that animation where you're putting down your sword each time. Alright. I really wish that I was able to use a controller with this. Like, it says that you can, but i uh, damned if I know. You know, I'm thinking about it. One of the most safest places you could be is be exactly where a cannonball just immediately landed because like what are the odds of another one oh wait what are the odds of another one uh being able to hit uh one of the biggest bitching and moans that i'm going to be doing is uh complaining about the using of the hey no 
using the keyboard and mouse. Wishing I could use a controller. Yeah. Oh, jeez. That's like super satisfying. Bam. Oh, you can see where the uh, cannonball landed. Yeah. All right. Now we get into one of the main mechanics of Prince of Persia. Is the parkour. In, far, in fact, I think I learned about parkour from this game. And also, don't let this game confuse you. Because this game has been around for like the longest time. Shall I continue my story from here the next time we're interrupted? Uh, sure. Uh... New save game. Done. Thank you. I'll start the story from here next time. Thank you. You're awesome. All right. Uh, cool. I always love that uh, running along walls thing. I had a friend who uh, told me he had dreams of uh, doing this. Uh, press action button. Turn on. Then press jump space to jump from the wall. Oh. Yeah. Oh, lucky me. Okay. Um, what's this? Run up wall, then... S oh, okay. Oh, I screwed that up. Nice. And there it lay, just out of reach. The dagger of time. There was a treasure I could carry with pride as a trophy of our victory. If I could only get there. Well, knowing this game. Uh, turn on the wall, then. Yeah. Oh! What was that all about? Let's see. First person. Eh? Uh, use... To look around. Well, how the hell do I get in there? Eh, okay. Um... How do I get up? Eh. Let's see. Well, I ain't gonna do. Could I run up this wall? Yes, I can. That's what I was hoping. Okay. That's a problem that I'm having so far with this game, is that uh, I can't exactly control the camera when I want to. Ooh. That's amazing for the time that this took place in. I mean, like, you get someone with modern technology to do shit like that. Um, what am I supposed to do? Okay. Do I just... Huh, oh, that wasn't so bad. Very dodgeable maneuver. Huh. Oh. Nice. Over. There we go. You know, it's so satisfying making grunting. Uh oh. Noises. What? That was an instant game over. No, no. That's not what happened. And I don't remember his voice being so pretentious. Hmm. Okay, avoid spiky pulls. Oh, no, 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 buddy. There you go. Down. There we go. Up, up. Okay. Alright. 
Now we go over this way. A jump. Mm, look at those daggers. Well, they're not really daggers. They're like sort of mini scythes. So, what I'm guessing is, is that instead of doing what I did, I have to do it the opposite way around. No! <clears throat> well. Wait, wait, wait. That's not... All right. Let's uh, try this one more time. I at least want to get past the part that I'm always having trouble on. Okay, we go over this way. Believe me, folks, I've beaten this game before. I, I completely agree with you if it doesn't seem like it. Alright. Ah. What am I doing wrong? Am I do I Wait. Do I need to do the special acts action thing again? I'm lisping and sucks. Okay. Mm-hmm. Mm. At this rate I would have been dead fifty times over because you know Princes can't get in water. Or then again, they can. They just can't fall in it. You know, they, 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 they just can't take defeat overall. What do I have to do? No, no, no. That I keep on doing the same thing over and over again. You know what? No, I'm, one more time. One more time. All right. There's no way that he would have died. That's not how it happened. I'm going to call that an episode here. In the next episode, I'm going to figure out what I've been doing wrong. All right, see you then. Bye.